All right, so here's the deal. We were gonna go to Dallas to go to a Ferrari event, see some cool cars, hang out with some friends I know uh, out there, and then go to a cigar lounge that I've never been to called Cigar Art, but uh, that I've heard is really good. But it is 82 degrees, sunny, and perfectly calm outside, so we're gonna do something else. Awesome. With Jesse and the Nika Rustica room. Oh, this place. Have I missed this place all winter long? Haven't been here. First time this year, Navajo Burger on Lake Worth. Oh, yeah. first time out this year actually since I think December 3rd that I came out on the lake here but the weather's absolutely beautiful the lake is glass that's my boat right there Joey's putting some gas in you guys know Joey from uh, skiing video uh, we're getting ready to go I don't know who's all coming it might just be uh, might just be us two but if that's the truth then, uh, then we'll get plenty of toes in and uh, this is my buddy's Lake house behind here. So I can get this thing to flip around for me. Ooh. Nope, it's not gonna. We'll just and uh, enjoy this beautiful view right here. Oh man, look at this. We have the entire lake to ourselves, and there is literally just miles of glass. Ridiculous. This is like the official, non-official start to summer. So, oh, gonna do some pulls, have some cigars, drink some beers, some cold drinks, make it a day. done at the lake I think we're gonna go find us a cigar shop near here I don't know have a couple drinks see if there's any food available All right, let's go on the road and I think this is what I'm gonna smoke the floor Dominicana avocado yes so this place has changed a lot in the last couple years since I've been here this humidor is absolutely massive now. They've got 
a lounge, they got a member area, they got an outdoor patio, um, and then the area where you check out has got its own separate entrance and hallway so that when you come in, you know, your wife or your girlfriend can come in, they can buy a stick, and they're not going anywhere where there's smoke. So you don't smoke outside uh, in the entryway or where people check out so they can come in. Um, that's a really nice feature. Uh, so we're going to, like I said, I'm going to smoke this La Avocado by La Flor Dominicana and uh, we're going to check this place out a little bit. They actually close in just a few minutes, but I think that the, uh, I think that the owner is going to stay here with us for a little bit while we, uh, we show off his store a little bit. So we're going to go buy these, sit down and show you some of the, uh, the rest of the shop. Just check out this outdoor space. It's a huge patio. They've even got the recliners out here, ceiling fans. Look at all this. TV's up there. This is just the outside space. Let's go inside, take a look at the members area. All right, so this is the members area. There's tons of lockers all over the sides here. Tons of these red leather chairs lined up. TVs everywhere. You want something on the TV, you can have your own TV. Kitchen, private bathroom. This place is just huge. Of course, this is where anybody can come have a seat and uh, have a cigar. They got some tables set up here because there was an event today. Actually, funny thing, I just missed Fabian with uh, Drew Estate. Their event was today, and I'm out on the lake messing around instead of coming to the event. This is standard lounge through here behind me you can see that's the entry hall right there and then of course they've got the checkout area through there the humidor so in, in total there's like one two three four four separate rooms and an outside patio I mean this place is money uh, you know they have a membership here and the, even though the store closes at seven the membership you can stay as long as you want you get a little key fob and come in go as you want they lock the rest of the store down but you can just 24 7 if you're a member man that is awesome i wish it was closer to home but it's not my home store it's a little bit further away but definitely will be back here and i can't believe i missed the drew estate event today mm. Man, this La Bocado is just so good. It's uh, it's a little bit different than La Lenox, which these two cigars are, and me, for me, different than all the other La Florida Minicanas that they've made. La Lenox was just real dark. This is just a little less, a little bit more chocolate, maybe a little bit more sweet, but it's really, really good. And uh, I've only had a chance to have a couple of them so far. Nice. So I'm just going to sit here and relax, enjoy the rest of the cigar, see if there's anything else that comes up to show you guys, see what happens the rest of the night.